I've learned a lot on health reforms, um, dress reform, um, courtship and marriage, evangelism, friendship evangelism, um, how to give Bible studies. ACE has been a really, really big blessing in my life. Um, I remember when I came, in, came to ACE, I did not know a lot of things in terms of like how to read my Bible, how to share my faith with other people, and how just to reach people in the community. It's just a burden just to talk to people, mingle with people, and just share the good news of Christ. Well, I came to ACE and I realized that I didn't even know. And ACE, for the four months, it's been a truly uh, humbling experience for me in my life. And the Lord has really helped me along the way. I'm sad for it to end, but I know there's one thing I'm taking away from here, is that the character of Christ has to be manifested in his people before he must come. I've also, also learned through prophecy and evangelism what I meant to do in the last days. I think ACE, the four month course has allowed me to recognize who I am as a Seventh Day Adventist and know what I'm meant to be doing in this world. And I've really enjoyed it. And I've learned so many communication skills. I've learned written skills through essays and assignments we did with prophecy. I've learned communication skills and we've been to town distributing leaflets and talking to a variety of different people. When I came to ACE, I didn't, I, I didn't really know what I, what I was actually coming here for. I thought that I'd be coming to learn the Bible, to just to do witnessing, to, to go out into the streets, but I realised that it was a whole lot more when I got here. Um, I learned a solemn message about dress reform, how to speak, how to act, how to live a Christian life, how to be like Christ. Since being here at ACE, God has given me a much clearer idea of the work that He has for His Seventh-day Adventist Church. And He's given me just a love for just getting out into the world and sharing His message of salvation with people. That's the main thing that I'm going to take with me. And um, just this clearer understanding of the messages that He's given and entrusted to us to share with people is going to stay with me for the rest of my life. And I'm so grateful for having this opportunity to come. And um, it's been amazing. We've learned so much. Um, we've learned so much in the prophetic words, the books of Daniel Revelation, <clears throat> and seeing the times in which we're living in, and seeing how important it is for us to truly understand this message for ourselves and study for ourselves and get that experience in order to be able to get that seal of God. Um, learned so much in evangelism and how we really need to evangelize and share this message with the world and not only is evangelism going to help others but it's so good for your own soul. We've learned so much about the pioneers, our history, our foundations and seeing how it's so important to not forget them. My time here at ACE has been such a blessing. God has blessed me through the health message, giving me a better understanding of his eight health principles and I've been able to see you know, the impact it's had not only on my own life but on the lives of others and God has given me an opportunity to share the health message with members of the community in Derby for five minutes at the campaign, at the five minute health spot and also we were able to have a brief at the Mind, Body and Spirit Health Fair and at the Dagenham Community Health Fair and it was such a blessing you know, to see people from the local community really wanting to understand and learn about God's healing principles the main bulk of our um, course was evangelism, which was really exciting because I've always wanted to share my faith with my family and my friends and with brethren in the church, but I just didn't know how to. And through learning about evangelism, God has taught me how to do Bible studies, how to preach, how to do carpooling, going door to door with servers and selling books. And also he's taught me about apologetics, you know, learning how to defend the faith. And, you know, my most memorable um, activity in ACE was studying the books of Daniel Revelation and through studying the prophets of Daniel Revelation God has really shown me you know, the work that he has for us to serve the event is to proclaim the third angel's message and I was able to understand that God is that in this time now God is preparing the people who will stand people who live by principle, live by the word of God and I've been able to understand you know, the work that Christ is doing right now the most holy place and you know, seeing the need for that same work to, and that same corresponding work in my own life. This has been one of the best experiences I've ever had in my life. I decided to start this school called ACE, Advanced Centre of Evangelism. And the reason being is because I could see that there was a need. I looked around, there was no school of evangelism in England. 
Well, I came into this church from the world, and so I had a passionate love for this truth. And it, the, one of the books that I first read was Great Controversy. And I just had such a burden to get that book to other people because the truth set me free, knowing this warfare between good and evil. And that burden has carried over into church members as well. Because when I see a lot of the young people, they don't have a passion for the message like I had when I first came in. And the reason is they're not reading, they're not studying. And so my burden for the school was that it would encourage the young people to really have a love to study their Bibles and the spirit of prophecy and apply it practically in their lives. So I decided to myself, what do I need to do to make this happen? The first thing that was holding me back was my job. And God, through a series of providential leadings, I was able to come out of my, my secular employment. And I thought to myself, what hinders me now? Nothing. So we moved forward and we ventured out in faith, stepped out um, as pioneers, and we started the A School of Evangelism. So one of the greatest blessings for me was seeing how the students on the first day they came and the growth, their personal growth and their walk with Jesus, how, how the, that developed during the four months. And you realize when you run a four month program, it's not long enough to do everything you want to do with these students because some of them have character um, defects or problems that are going to take longer than that to sort out. But just to give them a desire to sort them out and a desire to see how the standard that Christ sets for us. So my burden was for their character development, probably more than anything else, because if they have a vibrant walk with Jesus, they're going to want to share it with other people. So that's the basis of evangelism. During the time that I was at uh, uh, Leading Out With Ace, some of the highlights was just the, the, the atmosphere that we had. It was like a family. And also we found that the quality of the students, you know, as the week by week went, they were improving, they were growing the fruits. And just, the, just the going out into the mission field, it was exciting for them. One of the highlights we had, we spent a, a week in Wales and uh, we did some uh, singing in the, the, the town centres of the, the Welsh villages and, and for them, the, the Welsh people, this was a new experience. One of the most effective things we found during the school was doing um, singing in town. And so 10 of us or so would sing in town and four or five would give out tracts. And I think in one afternoon we had um, 20 people sign up for Bible studies, just two hours singing. And for me, it was tremendously exciting because so many times in the church it's very hard to get people to come out and do evangelism. And to have 17 young people all on fire to share Jesus with people, it was just, it was so tremendously encouraging to see people just being witnessed to. And also when we run the campaign, we ran the campaign for two weeks, to see the students mingling with the public and enjoying the work and just getting excited about doing it was just a tremendous blessing. So I'd encourage any young person out there, if they want to have a, a walk with God, and I think the times we're living in require us to have such a close walk with God because we know the time of trouble's coming and the preparation we need is to press together as never before. And that's something I felt we had in four months when you live together, you eat, sleep, talk, but Bible study together. That closeness that develops is tremendously special. Some of the key subjects that we cover um, at ACE is um, the books of Daniel and Revelation. Understanding prophecy, uh, I believe, is a key for our own personal uh, revival and reformation. And also just to help us have an understanding when we come to do our witnessing and sharing the Bible. I came in through uh, the prophetic message and there are many people that are interested in what's going to happen in the future what's going to happen um, in, in, in these last days there was a big rise with the, with the Da Vinci Code and there was a big rise with Nostradamus so there is an interest um, in this field so we, we train them in, in understanding these two critical books we also teach them the practical tools of how to give a Bible study not only how to give a Bible study, but how to share Christ as the central pillar of these Bible studies. How to create their own Bible studies and how to share these Bible studies. How to make Bible contacts. How to go door to door. We also uh, would get our students to practice how to preach. Twice a day we would have two preaching practice sessions. One in the morning and one in the evening. We'd call it morning worship and evening worship. Where the students would have an opportunity to develop sermons, to develop thoughts and to um, present these sermons and as a class we would have peer review, we would assess the sermons for style, delivery and content and by the end of the four months 
we found that the students had developed their sermon so powerful that many of us just felt we could not even comment any further on the sermon. So these are some of the things um, that we do in ACE and I really would encourage you to come to ACE, support ACE. ACE is a new school, it's a pioneer school and if it's not supported then there will not be a school for the United Kingdom. So I'd like to encourage you and I look forward to seeing you at ACE.